In this mock, we will talk about social marketing in social inclusion organizations. Out of all the benchmark criteria, we will only consider behavior change, audience research, and segmentation. These three aspects are the basis of the added value proposition that an organization must develop to succeed. The starting point is to identify the problem that needs a solution. The solution requires a behavioral change. Our organization is facing with a small number of children and young people playing sports. In this case, on the one hand, people with disabilities lose the benefits from the practice of sport. And on the other hand, the organization has no longer sportsmen and sportswomen in high-level competition. To understand the root of the problem, the audience must be investigated. In our problem, the audience research allowed us to find three interesting insights. In first place, parents and young people were not well informed about the benefits of sports. Secondly, many times, specialists such as doctors and physiotherapists did not provide enough information. Last but not least, the schedules offered by the organization's employees were not convenient. Timetables sometimes overlapped with parents' work and students' classes. To deal with that, more volunteers are needed. All these insights indicate that an organization does not really have a customer orientation philosophy. All in all, there is not a structured communication program, just informal conversations, and the employees do not have enough time to provide an adequate service. Organizations cannot attend everything for everybody. They need to identify specific targets and specific objectives. In our problem, there were four objectives to be reached. To sensitize parents, sensitize doctors, sensitize therapists, and ultimately attract volunteers to extend the support services provided by the organization. And four different targets or segments identified to solve the problem. Parents, therapists, doctors, and possible new volunteers. Finally, for the value creation process, two marketing strategies were designed and implemented. An awareness communication campaign focused on parents, doctors, and therapists, and a public relations event focused on potential new volunteers. The best methods for the selected segments, parents, doctors, and physiotherapists, was chosen. In this case, a different image and a different slogan was used for each month of the year. Afterwards, an event was designed. Also, a flyer was created and properly distributed to announce it. In conclusion, successful organizations have a problem-solving approach, and social inclusion marketing provides useful tools to this end.